Consumers in the developed world are not buying as much as they used to from producers in the emerging world. That's the conclusion from the latest trade data from the US and the UN, which show US imports from emerging exporters falling in both value and volume terms for the past few months, and imports by the developed world as a whole falling particularly sharply this year. Now, you might expect the value of what industrialised countries import from the emerging world to have fallen recently, because a lot of it consists of oil and other commodities. But despite a recovery this year, prices for those goods are still far below what they were a couple of years ago. And in many cases, the volume of trade is falling too, including, for example, the volume of goods the US imports from China, which are mostly manufactured goods and not commodities. The story is far from uniform and some emerging market exporters have been doing extremely well. For example, US imports from Vietnam have been consistently rising in recent years. But for emerging markets as a whole, the aggregated data are worrying. According to the UN, exports of both goods and services from the emerging world are now falling for the first time since the global financial crisis. And this has to be a worry for emerging markets, which make up about half of the world's economy in terms of purchasing power parity. In the past, their growth depended largely on supplying demand in the developed world. If that demand is falling, they will struggle to find a new path to growth through trade. 